I'll just use Jesse's dollar for that. We pay the man. So I want to get it. Like, you ready to give your money to Jackson? So he's like, I'm ready to get it back. <laughs> <laughs> We're good to go whenever you guys are. Final destination version of F Zero. All right, guys. Uh, this is Nine Tails here commentating on the losers' run two match between Not Heroes and the Super Fudinari Bros. I don't like that name. <laughs> uh, I'm just I'm just uh, filling in for Shy when I say that my uh, commentating partner isn't here with me right now. So um, starting off, things are not looking good for Peach specifically. Uh, she's taking a lot of damage early on. And it looks like uh, the Fudinari Bros are sort of in a more control situation. Not really now, though. The uh, not here is taking over stage control. Oh, it's good back throw. Back throw for Mario works really well in doubles, just because uh, when Mario starts twirling that opponent around, they turn into a hitbox on their own. So it like breaks up attempts to punish by enemies. And Trio Lash launches a surprise Shadow Ball underneath everyone to snipe out Peach. And then, in a uh, really good uh, moment of clarity, fills up uh, Bro Bear's bucket, which he uses to now take Peach's second stock. Peach isn't the heaviest character, so a bucket with a Shadow Ball in it can kill at very low percents like we just saw right there. So, um, Peach has been taking a lot of stocks. So it looks like she might need to shock, stock share if uh, things keep up this way. And it's not good. It's uh, not good for the not heroes. <laughs> they um, are in a 4-6 to six stock scenario right now. So they gotta kick it into gear if they want to win this match. Oh, and Mario gets caught on a roll with the forward smash from uh, Robert's uh, Forward smash. I guess I already see that. All right. Ooh, Jam putting on some really nice pressure on the Mewtwo there with the fireballs. That was a really good approach. Oh, and okay. It'd be interesting to see some uh, well-timed capes from Jam uh, that could uh, really punish those. That was that very obvious shadow ball and stuff like that. All right. Um, all right, it uh, looks like Peach got a back throw kill on Game & Watch. I guess that's what you, uh, that's just what happens. One thing um, about the Food and Art, Super Food and Art Bros is they're playing a team of characters that are incredibly light. Mewtwo is actually the second lightest, and uh, Game & Watch is the third lightest of all the characters in the game. So, they, die, they both die pretty fast. Um, like from Peach's back throw. Alright, it looks like uh, Peach finally lost her last stock, but we are not in a share select situation. And that was a very nice um, forward air by Mario, taking out uh, Churro's second stock, but it was seemed kind of accidental to me. It looked like he was actually aiming for... Uh, that was weird. It seemed like he was actually aiming for uh, Robear when he, when he landed it. Alright, it looks like Churro's trying to kill Game & Watch for some reason. Um, and the bucket ends everything. And that's going to be uh, game one going to the Super Fernando Bros. Those super light, super, well, Game Watch isn't that floaty, but kind of floaty characters. We'll have to see what um, Not Heroes decide to counterpick. I'm expecting that if we see any character switches, it'll come from the Super Fernando Bros. Not Heroes seem to be sticking with just their mains which are uh, Peach and Mario. Uh, but Churro and Robear have been switching up a lot in this double sermon so far. We've seen uh, Zero Suit, Mario, uh, Little Mac, uh, Donkey Kong, so it looks like no character switches here, though. And the counter pick is going to be another variation of FD, so we're going to FD both games here. We're going to Kalos League. And I don't know if anyone watching this played Pokemon X and Y, but this was a really sick Elite Four experience in my opinion. Like, really cool, and I'm glad the stage is in this game. Alright, um, let's see here. Not a whole lot of big interest going on here, a lot of uh, smash punishes, which is, I guess, what you see more often in doubles. 
hope people play a lot less safe <laughs> because they can get away with it. They've got teammates backing them up. All right, Smash Four Singles is about to get started. And if you do not hear your name, you're not currently in the bracket. Then you need to come talk to me. Jaxus, D-Man, Shy, Ninetales, Churro, Robear, Trevor, Chari, Wolfie, Bombchuling, Sword Legion, Zeno, Meta64, Kaku, Ninja Sashin, Captain Brad, Triforce of Ginger, Wizard Kelly, That Guy, Dongo, and Ace RS. All right, there you go. That's the uh, full bracket for singles we'll be experiencing later. Um, looks like Mewtwo picked up a back air kill on Peach while that was going on, and uh, is going to maybe try for some other type of stuff. Wow, so Mario's, um, a lot of characters are really high percent here. Uh, Game & Watch loses a stock, so we're actually at an even stock count right now. Um, Chiro, or Mewtwo needs to be careful here. Oh, he picks up that back air kill. That was not an off the side kill, but there's no way Mario can recover from that. Um, and wow, these two are really good. Every time um, someone is dead and recovering on the platform, they find a good moment to fill up the bucket with that Shadow Ball. And now um, anyone facing Bro Bear needs to be really careful that bucket's going to definitely kill Peach or Mario from where they're at right now. Alright, Mario putting on some fireball pressure, not working out for him. It looks like Churro and Bro Bear are picking up a uh, stage control. And their edge guard attempt did pick off one of Peach's stocks. And Bro Bear gets an I think that was an up smash on Mario. I didn't quite see it off the side of my eye there. I was watching the right side. Um Churro versus Bro Bear right. will be the next matchup for Bro however I'm pretty sure they're in doubles. Yep, they are. Alright. Probably soon. I think this is gonna be the last game of the set, maybe. Um Alright. So Round one pairing for Smash Four singles. Ninetales versus Jaxis. Shari versus Churro. G-Man versus Wolfie. Zeno versus Shy, Ninja Sashin versus Grover, Meta64 versus Sword Legion, Dongo versus Kaku, Trevor versus That Guy, Bong Chulink versus Wizard Kelly, Triforce and Ginger versus Paris, and Captain Brad versus Ace Horace. Alright, Bro Bear picked up a really nice kill there, and it sounds like I have to go against Jaxus in my round one, so poor me. Alright, um. Please find your opponent, find an open setup, and get your match going. If you are currently doing a friendly match on a Smash 4 TV, please get off the TV. Alright, so, um, in general, I just want to apologize for the commentary on this particular set. We ended up with a lot of tournament announcements taking over it, but whatevs. Oh, wow, okay, that was a pretty cool Shadow Ball there to finish that off. Good game to Funari Bros. They took it 2-0. Um, and uh, I hope we get to see more of Not Heroes in the future. Yeah, some cool players, and I love the Peach Mario team. That's super fun. You guys need to stay there.